It's not often that puppets find their way into the news, but it's happened a lot this week, all thanks to comments by a former writer of Sesame Street about the relationship of two of the show's best-known characters, Bert and Ernie. The topic sparking huge response on social media from leaders of the LGBT community. Faustman's Chelsea Irizarry joins us from Woodbury with that story. It seems that everyone grew up watching the children's television show Sesame Street. And earlier this week, a longtime writer, Mark Saltzman, announced that two of the show's iconic characters were written as a loving couple reflecting his own same-sex relationship. Many around the nation taking that as a yes to Bert and Ernie's romantic relationship status. It's just something so positive for all of our kids and all the parents to see that, um, that there is a, a loving gay couple um, who have uh, little, little quarrels and little fights just like every other couple. New York LGBT Network President and CEO David Kilmanick says the two characters are known throughout the world as children's icons. And if the two are in a relationship, it will help parents discuss the LGBT community with children at a young age. This really gives an opportunity for parents to have real conversations uh, with our young kids, that there are all different kinds of families. Additionally, it will allow children to truly express themselves freely, promoting inclusion among all. We need to show that there are LGBT people, that there are LGBT couples, and this visibility will save lives. In response, Sesame Street's parent company took to Twitter by writing in part that puppets do not have a sexual orientation and the pair are best friends. The post was later deleted. I think Sesame Street was worried that they were going to face a backlash. Regardless, Kilmanick says for the years that Saltzman was writing the show, Bert and Ernie were modeled after one man's relationship with the love of his life. The fact of the matter is we're either gay, straight, um, or whatever our sexual orientation is, and it's not about, you know, what anatomy we have. It's about what's in your heart and who you love and who you want to spend time with. Kilnick says portraying this relationship in the media is just one way to let millions of kids know that they belong. From Woodbury, Chelsea, Arizari, Fios One News.